Hey, what is up guys? Brandon here, and today I'm bringing you guys another episode of the Builders Spotlight series. I think we're on episode 4 now, and today I'm bringing you guys another house by Landy005, and guys, I'm I'm not just doing houses by him, I promise, but um, he just keeps on supplying me with more and more builds to review, and I mean, how can I say no? He's a great builder, and um, yeah. So if you guys have any builds you want me to review, definitely send me a link down in the comments below. Or send me a link via Twitter. I do have a couple other houses by other builders to review, but nonetheless, I still need more things to review. So if you have anything like that you want me to check out, then definitely leave me a download link. And what is this? Okay, so this is not the house, but um, the house is right over this mountain. But the thumbnail said modern house, and I didn't really mean to mislead you guys, but this is not exactly a modern house. It is a suburban slash medieval house. But I just put modern house because I was too lazy to make a new thumbnail. Whoops. But um, as you guys can tell, I'm using the Wavy World um, shaders, that mod pack. I was originally going to use the actual shaders pack, but the house looked really weird. And the shadows were glitching out, so I just decided not to do that, not to use that. So I'm going to be using the Wavy World instead. So let's just walk down over here. See, suburban medieval style house by Landy005. There's his Twitter. And wait. Alright, we're back. Sorry guys, someone walked in my room while I was recording, so I had to pause really fast. But um yeah, we were saying suburban medieval styled house by Landy005. There's his Twitter. And I kinda like this thing. I don't know what it is, but I like it. And if you guys notice, I'm trying something new. Um I don't have my GUI on while recording. This is something I'm trying to do, but sorry if I like walk into walls or something, because I don't exactly know where the control pad is. But, um, yeah, right over here we have, like, the mailbox. I think that's pretty cool. And we're just going to do a quick flyby of the house. Um, very nice gate with the opening, the glowstone. So let's just fly around. We have the bushes and, uh, the gate. That's pretty cool with the quartz and oak, um, combination. So he definitely did put a lot of effort into the garden. It looks really nice. I like, it seems like he's on using the color scheme of orange and blue. And quite honestly, that they complement each other very nicely. Orange and blue are... Great colors to use together, as well as the occasional white, and hey, I love it. But I mean, let's just focus on the house. They have a nice little tower. I love the curve of the roof. That looks super nice, and then just the different layers. The trees look great, and um, yeah, if you guys notice, see how the bushes, they're multiple leveled. It's not just a straight line of bushes. That's something that you guys should be taking notes on, you know, noting if you guys are a builder, things to do. See how, like, this one doesn't just go straight across, it goes sort of out, stuff like that. Just gives it more depth and honestly makes it look better as a whole. There is another pathway over here, and this is the garage. There's the door with the ladder, you know, to pull it open. And, um, yeah, so let's go into the front door. Um, it's already open. Whoops, forgot to close it. Okay, now let's open it. So we can go left or right or straight. Let's just go left and make our way around. So, um, I believe there's supposed to be a dead bush over here. Not sure. So I'm just gonna, just gonna, where'd it go? Where'd it go. I'm just gonna place one because I think there's supposed to be one there. But um, yeah. Uh, we got a nice little window here. And um, Landy, if you are watching this video, something I just want to let you know. Uh, can, can you not use jungle wood just because they're not transparent and wavy world doesn't affect them? So like, could could you please use something different, a different style of leaves? Because that'll make it look a lot better. But nonetheless, still looks great. So we have the computer over here with the keyboard, which is a powered rail, looking out on the lawn. We got some bookshelves, so I'm guessing this is a study. Uh, we have a small little kitchen over here with the chests, with the supplies, uh, the furnaces or ovens. Right over here, I guess this is another sort of library, guys. That is something that you guys can always do. Um, it's a very notable design, a lot of people do it, but placing books under a staircase. It sort of disguises it as a staircase, like you guys wouldn't guess this is a staircase. Because there's books underneath it, but, whoa, it's a staircase. Alright, over here we have a painting of, um, a guy who sort of reminds me of Morpheus. I don't know why. Don't judge me. Uh, over here we have Mr. Thomas with some bananas. I don't know. Don't judge me again. Uh, we have this, um, dining table with, um, these represent the plates, guys. I use this design myself, so this is just something you guys can do. I use, uh, carpet as a plate. We have a chest, some cake, I can't open the chest, more books, this house has a lot of books, oh look, more books, some cake, right over here, a microwave, I like the microwave, and I'm guessing this is a stove with the, I believe those are furnaces with powered rails on top, 
we go down over here, we have the garage with the recycling and the trash can. I sort of said garage with an accent. That was weir weird. Landy's car to steal your girl over my dead body. So we have the car. Next stop, your girl's house over my dead body. So we have the furnace, like the engine with the powered rail. And this looks very nice. I like it. Uh, so we need to go over here. We have more books. Like, damn, you have a lot of books. And a TV. So I really like this TV with the, the, I think it's called chiseled quartz. That design looks pretty cool. It matches the TV. I like it. And especially this thing, it's like a divider, but you can kind of look through. Uh, Landy's sort of known for doing stuff like that. And honestly, it looks nice. I love it. And, um, yeah. So, uh, over here we have a nice little chandelier. We have the balcony. Uh, let me just parkour. Parkour. Parkour back. Ooh, wait, can I jump on that? I'm gonna jump on that. Got this. Nope, just kidding. Uh, so over here we have a nice little seating area, although we can hit our head on that thing. Um, we have some plants, uh, nice little bushes over here, like a divider, with the books, guys. Uh, we have a chest, we have a balcony over here, and it's becoming nighttime. He did build a medieval house over there, I think that looks pretty cool. We can just look down on the front garden. Uh, we have a carpet, I quite like that. Uh, we have some chests, or one chest, pardon me. And it's dividing, there's a little divider over here. Uh, I believe this is a bed, with the cushion. Um, let's see, what's over here? We have another balcony. I like the cobwebs, that sort of gives it a medieval feel. And it kind of makes it look old, but because they're out of the way, not particularly. And I better hurry up before it becomes night. So, secret way to your girl. So it says turn left, so let's turn left. And we have bookshelves, Shrek. Hi, I'm Shrek. Not anymore, you're not. So we have a nice little seating area, torches, cobwebs, and, um... I should have read the sign, that Shrek. Okay, here's the secret. Uh, so we're going down. I'm guessing this is going to be a dungeon. Oh yeah, it's definitely a dungeon. This is a dungeon. This is a dungeon. Your girl. Help. No, just no. No, we're done. We're done. We're done. This never happened. This wasn't here. This, um, this, this dungeon did not exist. Landy, I'm sorry, this dungeon did not exist. I'm, me what? This, d no, no dungeon, bye. And we have some nice hay bookshelves. I mean, this looks really nice. And, um, bye-bye dungeon. And, um, oh, I think this is like a little sewer area. I can't, I, it goes nowhere. Um, that was not a dungeon. I didn't, I didn't do that. And, um, yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah. I think that's all of the house. Um, I don't think I blew anything up that was too important. But um, yeah, I hope Landy doesn't get too pissed at me. But that dungeon was weird. Made me uncomfortable. But um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, we're just going to take another fly around of the house at night, guys. And um, yeah, if you guys did enjoy, definitely drop a like down below. Show your support. Smash that like button. And um, if you guys haven't already, subscribe. So Landy over here made some towers. Um... He made a heart made of he was trying medieval i believe yeah medieval builds right over here but um yeah we're gonna focus on the house so we're just gonna do a flyby like i said at night and um yeah so like i said before if you guys have any builds that you want me to review then leave a download link or just a link to mcpe hub it doesn't even have to be yours if there's just something you want to see reviewed then definitely leave a link down below. I'll definitely check it out. Maybe give you guys... I'll, I will most likely give you guys credit if you guys showed me or built it. And, um... Yeah. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.